The arrival of her royal beautiness, her royal majesty, Rita Dominic, the newest and freshest bride in town. Alrighty guys, I highly welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. And if you're old, you're super, super welcome. And guys, next you're going to be watching Moment, the mothers of Anosike. Fidelis Anosike came out to receive Rita Dominic. It was an awesome moment. Yes, the day she has been waiting for. Every woman waits for that day. Yes, so it's a joyful one when the family of your husband receive you with so much joy and excitement. Hmm. I pray they don't switch. <laughs> you guys, if you're new to my work, my channel and you haven't subscribed, please, if you look down below right now, you see a red subscription button, please click on it. And also beside there's a notification bell, also click on it so you always get notified whenever I post a video. You'll be the first to watch, like, and share, and leave your comments below. So you guys, with the Dominic's wedding that took a talk, a toll around everybody's life, around the world so many people are talking about it everyone was excited at the fact that she got married so beautiful to a handsome man that loves her so genuinely and so dearly the love was obvious as in a marriage has not been talked about like this in recent times the last occasion the last occasion that we had that was popularly talked about and things happened and people really was over People really talked about it was the one when uh, Obi Kobana did his mother's funeral at Obi in Nanambra State. But this time around, the change, I mean, the move, the, the sweep of people talking about it moved itself from Anambra to Imo State. There's still a connection because the man is actually from Anambra. So Anambra people moved to Imo State to shake the ground again. But this one, Imo people shake campus because... Rita Dominic is a Nollywood actress, so she had more crowd, and she's the emo lady. So emo and uh, Anambra people, Ibo Kwenu, <laughs> the Ibo Kwezuenu, I hail D. You guys are amazing. In short, you're the best people you can have in Nigeria. Ibo people, I love Una. Una too much. Hey, Kwezuenu, hey, let's shake the beat, shake the beat. <laughs> so watch the video moment. Uh, Rita Dominic was received by her husband, family. So that was it about with a Dominic reception into Anambra State and the family of Fidelis Anosike, the publisher. And now let's talk about how Fidelis Anosike fell in love with Rita Dominic. According to what he posted on his Instagram page, he said lots of things led him to falling in love with Rita Dominic. But the one that led him the most was how she talks very softly, her soft spoken words, the way she just that she has a pattern of doing the things so she began <laughs> or he began by surprising her with beautiful bouquets 
beautiful bouquets as you can see in this video where she saw that she fell in love beautiful bouquets and cakes and lots of other edibles he said her soft words the way she carries herself her beautiful face he mentioned a whole lot of things when i was just going through those videos i'm like ah oh, this is so much love who wouldn't love this kind of love i am in love with with a dominic and an Aussie case love aren't you in love with it I am in love with it, my people. And we'll still say a very big congratulations to Tim Godfrey who tied the knot yesterday. I think this April is a month of weddings and traditional marriage. Mm -hmm. Weddings and traditional marriage. Everybody's just married. Uh, if I wasn't married, I would still be married again by this time. <laughs> Because I want to tap from this anointing. So you guys, yeah, lots of people have been calling me. Ah, keep doing your work, girl. I'm somebody's wife. Oh. <laughs> also, you guys, back to what we were talking about. So you're going to be watching videos of what really made our dear publisher, Fidelis Anosiki, fall deeply in love with the very beautiful, stunning, amazing, intelligent, outspoken, soft-spoken, as he fondly calls her that she's soft spoken so let me use the word from the king himself <laughs> soft spoken Rita Dominic to see what really led to him falling so 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 deeply in love with uh, Rita Dominic and taking it to the next level by paying her bright price and making it official to every one of us that's talking about it today we are happy gender issue which is a major problem in our society what do you think about you know scripts like should they be more yes i mean because i feel that I, I keep saying this television is a very powerful tool and we have to realize and understand that that we can use television to correct the ills of the society to shape the society into the society we want it to be which is what hollywood did with america and we're hoping that we can do that with nollywood and we're hoping that by telling these kinds of stories, we're giving strength to the people suffering from, you know, any kind of abuse, be it uh, uh, physical, mental abuse, VVF. You know, we're giving them strength. We're giving them hope. We're telling them it's okay to speak up. We're telling them it's not okay to suffer in silence. It's not okay to die in silence. We're give, making them understand and, and know that they're not worthless as they've been made to feel. So it's important that we tell these kinds of stories, yeah away from the event you've been away from the event you've been in a business for quite a while now young girls who want to get into the film business what would you tell them that look this is something you seriously need to focus on to be able to create that longevity in the film industry well it's really about um, you just have to have a passion for the arts because I, I something I realized is I realized that a lot of young young people who want to come into the industry they, they, they approach me and they say to me, oh, I want to be a star. And I always say to them, I don't understand what that means because it just shows that you're not interested in the work as an actor or a filmmaker or a musician, be it whatever it is you want to do. Because the moment you concentrate on being a star, you leave out the work. And people are not interested in that. They want to see your work. Concentrate on your work as an actor or a filmmaker or a musician and then wow you guys that was amazing isn't it it really was all right i hope you enjoyed this video please don't forget to hit on the subscribe button like and share leave a comment below